Hey, my rats and all that. <laughs> so today we are eating some Indian food. Um, yeah, I literally wrote down everything that we're eating today just so that I don't mess up names or what we're eating. I don't want to mess up anything. So I literally wrote everything down. We got some rice. Um, well, we had ordered rice with butter chicken, <laughs> but they didn't even send the rice. So we just got butter chicken here. That's some butter chicken. I'm gonna take the lid off. That's all we got, y'all. Cause they sent the rice, so we're gonna test it with our um our garlic bread. We also got. Let me show y'all a little close up of the bread and the chicken. Yes. Okay, and then we got some china chat, which is pretty much right here. This is the china chat, and this is chickpeas with onions and green pepper. So we're going to do this again. Oh my gosh, y'all, I'm scared. It's like a salad. It looked like a salad. We eat salad, but this just looks different. If I showed you guys, it was spilled. So, <laughs> yeah. yeah, so I can't even bring it that close to the camera, y'all. Um, and then we got some aloo tiki. Which is just fried potatoes, which is right here, y'all. They smell like like some egg foo young from a Chinese restaurant. Like, it smells mad good. And I don't know if it's the New York in us, but that smells <laughs> that smells like some roast pork egg foo young. And then um, we got chicken chicken kebabs, which is just like chicken on a stick. You know how you go to your like trucks and get chicken on a stick. And, yeah, that's what that is. So we're about to get into it. We're gonna give you our honest opinion. Yeah. <laughs> and we got some sauce on, on the side. We got some Louisiana hot sauce just in case. Y'all know I like heat. So yeah. And then we got some ranch. Yeah, wishbone. Gotta have a wishbone. Let me give y'all a close up of the Louisiana. Alright. Facts. And then you guys, they sent us some sauce. I'm not sure exactly what it is, but we gonna find out. Can y'all see that? It's different. So. We gonna see y'all, we gonna see. Guys, did you tell you what my husband just told me? I ain't even realized. So the rice is underneath the chicken. I don't know why they did it like that, but we're gonna deal with it or whatever. But yeah, we ordered tech no, to be truthful, we ordered two orders of this. Um, butter chicken over rice. They sent one order. Okay. Um, yeah, we're gonna see what's up with that. But I'm definitely um <laughs> making sure we get our refund. You nobody know, paying that. <laughs> <laughs> um <laughs> I don't know what to try first. I think I'm gonna try to consider it. I must have just straight try the chicken. <laughs> yeah, I, I, this garlic bread smells like try. red lobster. I ain't even gonna hold you, it smells like mad red lobsters in here. So chicken's right here, I'm gonna try a piece of this. Okay, I think I'm gonna try a chicken kebab, y'all. Not big, y'all. Right. I never had a chicken kebab, truthfully. You know, like, it tastes like bread, it tastes like probably. Super garlic. You gotta chew a few to get the actual taste when it comes to like meat. That's good. Yes? It's cool. Mm -hmm. It looks like this one. Mm -hmm. This is good too. I'm gonna try to give them. Like, yo, I mean, <laughs> I'm trying not to be so hood, sorry. <laughs> it's New York. Right, it's the New York and I'm sorry, y'all. But, um, the chicken kebab, it tastes like, it got, like, green onions already in it. 
onions already in it. Like, it's seasoned so well. It's probably one of those rolls. Mm-hmm. It almost tastes like, you know how when you get food from the truck and you gotta add the onions and you gotta add the green peppers? Everything is, like, incorporated already in the chicken. Oh, this is good. Yeah. That's good. Mm-hmm. That's very good. I would throw this right in, like, a lettuce wrap. With some I lettuce. Was just thinking that. <laughs> with some lettuce and some tomato. French dressing. Oh French my. dressing. Oh my gosh, y'all. Mm -hmm. mm. It got a spice to it too. It do. A nice slice. And that's what I like. like. I like food that got spice to it. Um. No, I think I'm gonna keep this right here. A lot of the food that we ordered have spice added to it. We like spice, so we got extra just in case it wasn't spicy enough, but. Well, they got a nice place. Let me take, take this garlic bread with you. Mm -hmm. Mommy's having like, um, like, I don't want to say like, like, pizza maybe? Mm -hmm. Yes, it gave me like pizza. Mm. But it's like garlic. Oh, it's yeah. like garlic bread, but it's like, it's, I can't explain it. It's good. Oh yeah, I do get like the pizza vibe you're talking about. Mm-hmm. It's like garlic knots. Mm-hmm. Yes. It's but it's like in a bread. Okay, I'm gonna take the piece of chicken, y'all. It looks so good. I hope it tastes as good as it looks. It's really good. The chicken. It's got a nice spice to it. That is spicy. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, I don't mind. I forgot. Well, to those that didn't see the previous videos, me and my husband got new piercings. I have a tongue ring and he have a lip ring. So I'll eat and it's a little slow, y'all. Please be with us. <laughs> we gotta adjust to it. So please be with us. I just feel metal clasping. Oh my gosh, yo, the metal part? Yeah, it's metal hitting the It's different. Like, like, we love our piercings, but we love the metal part. Yeah, it's like a little bit of 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 a little we should do it together, like on the counter. Okay. I'm with that. Oh, we going to the school. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know other way to do it. <laughs> like, it's, it's like, it's, you know, it's juicy. Right. So. We might as well. You gotta, like. Okay, I'm gonna take this one. That's. I got mad onions in my spoon. I'm an onion lover, by the way. Cool. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Everything got spice to it. That's spicy, and that's exactly why, like, I feel like it's a lime in there. I get that lime. Yeah, that's, that's why it's got a piece of lime in there. Yeah, it's, it's like, the onions for me. They put also, it said they put like mollish. I mean, I don't want to get nothing wrong, y'all. So please don't come for, come for me. But. Yeah, I had like some spicy lotus in there. That's mm. probably where this green is coming from. It is, truthfully. Mm -hmm. like, that's spicy. And like, the inside of my lips, like around my piercing, it's burning it's right now. <laughs> um, smoke on that one. Y'all ever had doubles? I don't know if it's a New York thing, but if you ever had doubles, you get the concept a little bit. Kind of the same. Like, yeah. You chickpeas taste. I like this. I like this. I want to try the potato. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> like, I feel like I forgot. How do get the potato, y'all? I'm so bad. That looks good. Double. Really? Oh my gosh. Y'all, if this is like a double, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fall on my chair. Seriously, but like a potato. 
Oh my gosh. Double vibe. <laughs> oh my god, don't make me fall. <laughs> it definitely gives me that vibe when I take a few of it. So great. Double. How y'all feel today? Hey, Brad, how y'all feel today? I'm gonna have another piece of this bread. It's double. Oh my gosh. Let me get back to my double first. <laughs> my potato. Yeah, I was trying to show y'all, but um, the camera had died. So look, look inside of it. Can y'all see that? They did really good with that. I give them that. It don't even taste like a potato. Mm. I will put a little bit of salt and pepper on this. Potato where? Where is it potato? I bet you it's gonna taste good, but French will be better. Mm. With the kebab mm -hmm. chicken. Mm. That's fire. You make me want to taste it like that. Fire. Got a little bit of dressing on there. We're going to see how this tastes. This is a little hot sauce, too. Let's just wild. take it all the way up a notch. Cause I don't know how to act. You already got the spice to it. I can't do it. <laughs> <laughs> nah. I don't know how to act. You already have a spice to it. I can't do it. Can y'all see that? Mm. And that's what it is. That's hot. Mm. Oh my gosh. That's the chicken. Mm -hmm. That's good. Uh, it's kicking. It's hot. They did really good with this one. Oh, D. I don't know what spice that is, but like. All the chicken. I mean. <laughs> that's hot. All the seasoning that they put in here. Um, the green pepper and the onion, they incorporated it really well. I give them that. Yeah, that's hot. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have another piece of this chicken. Have you guys ever tried Indian food? Make sure y'all drop a comment down below. If y'all ever tried Indian food, and um, what was your reaction on it? How did you guys feel? Uh, I just got halal vibes a little bit of that um, kebab. Seriously. It's hot and it's really, really good. Mmm. My lip burning. <laughs> I'm telling you, one, I knew one of them was doing it. Mmm. -hmm. Whichever one. It's either the chicken or that. I think it's the kebab, like you it's said. The kebab. Mm, yeah, nice spice. Oh, this music is fire. Mm -hmm. mm. That's good. And then it also got, um, I'm trying to figure out what's the, I'm tasting something like this chicken, this butter chicken. Tomato. Mm. Tomato basil like. Basil yeah, taste. I'm getting like basil vibes, tomato vibes. Mm -hmm. I wish they would have did by what I order, but whatever, you know. We're grateful for what we did get. Truthfully. But when you spend your money on something, you should get what you pay for. Truthfully. That's good. Chicken, chicken. I want to check out the sauce. Let's taste the sauce real quick. I'm a little scared, <laughs> but. <laughs> but I don't know. I'm not sure what the sauce is. All right. I'm going to give it a smell first. Um, I just don't know what's supposed to be dipped in the sauce. I'm going to assume the kebab. I thought about that like a few minutes ago. Right, I was trying to figure out like what is that still dipping here? I'm pretty sure somebody may tell us. But yeah, y'all, we just gonna take a I 
don't think a balloon's gonna come up. <laughs> it's probably for like the black. I don't even taste it. Okay. I don't get no taste. Yeah, you just said no, look, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> that's how I'm I, I don't got no taste. I don't know. Maybe I'm eating it wrong. But that's okay because we live and we learn, right? This is our first time having um, okay, I get like Indian food, guys. Like, right, it has like a dressing taste. So okay. like. Maybe you're supposed to put this on the butter chicken. Mmm. Like over top of it? Mm hmm. Mmm. So, like, maybe match out with the tomato sauce taste. Because, like, that's like, it tastes like ranch, maybe. That would kind of make sense, too, because. Um, it kind of looks like ranch. Actually. Right, it do. It really do. It has, like, a rich, like, flavor. I would, um, I would agree with what you said, because. It's almost like halal food, how we have white sauce and... I feel like it's to balance it out. Yeah. It's, it's spicy, like it has a spice to it. So like, I feel like maybe you're supposed to put that sauce on top of that. Mm. Because I'm not sure, I'm just not going <laughs> <I'm not> gonna... <laughs> <laughs> to... This is just our thoughts, guys. Um, you know, <clears throat> excuse me. I'm not trying to be offensive. Yeah, we're we, we not being offensive or anything like that, you guys. We're just trying Indian food. And like I said, this is our first time. So we're just giving our honest feedback and our honest review. Truthfully, I'm big on culture. I want to make fun of other cultures. So. We're going to take one more bite of this potato, y'all. And then we're going to be out here. Don't mind my nails, please. All right? Dang, like I know somebody gonna say something, but look. It's a hard night. <laughs> it's cool, mommy like, you know what I'm saying? And let me give you guys a little, look, let me give you ladies, first of all. I was gonna say, let me give you guys, but let me give you ladies a little heads up when you get your nails done. Cause I had to learn this the hard way. Like I learned this this time around. When you get your nails done, don't get them so thin and sharp. Whatever design you decide to get, pointy, coffin, whatever. Don't get them so thin, don't get them so sharp because they'll be easier to break. I learned that the hard way. So put a little, how can I say? Um, yeah, put a little fullness in your nails. Like don't get them so thin and sharp because it, it makes it weak. Instantly. Yeah, and we don't want that. Y'all know I ain't, y'all know I ain't get my nails done that long ago, and look how they look, right? So I just broke all of them, made it for it. That's good, but we gonna get out of here, you guys. Mhm. Mm what is your favorite part of testing Indian food, trying Indian food today? All right, truth me. Mm -hmm. The fried potato. That's my favorite part too. The kebab. Mm-hmm. And like it might sound funny, but like this too. Really? It gave me like a like a potato chickpea vibe. Like yeah, with, we like double y'all. Like so this definitely vibe. made us like catch that vibe. The bread was cool. The butter chicken is really good. But like truthfully, like the kebab is really my favorite. The spice of it is really, really, really good. Yeah, I like the garlic bread. It made me feel like we had a big red lobster piece of bread on our plate. Um, the potato was my favorite, hands down. I like the chicken kebab, that was so amazing. I like how they incorporate the green peppers and the onions and the, the red peppers. You can see the red peppers and all throughout the kebab. Um, this was pretty good too. I like doubles, so this gave me the doubles vibe, like my husband said. I like the butter chicken. Um, I kind of just wish the restaurant itself didn't mix it like that, like the way they did it. Um, yeah, I kind of like more like my rice to be dry, or if I mix it, I would rather mix it myself. Right. The restaurant kind of messed up there. It's not cultural. It's the restaurant that kind of did that one. And... Yeah, everything was pretty good though. I would definitely try this again. Would you try this again, baby? Yeah, I would try it again. I want to also say like it had like a zesty taste. That's mm -hmm. that's what I was trying to say earlier. It was like a zesty. Yeah, I like the 
lime taste to it. Right. Or I like potato, that. or maybe, I'm not sure what that is. But right. It's, it's really good. I like it. It might be potato, potato and chickpeas. That's I see a lot of onions. I see green pepper, um, lime, and relish. It's, I think it's potato in there. It could be too. When I taste. chewed, it tastes like something that gave me like the taste of potato. I taste that too, like mush. <laughs> like now that we're talking about it, I smell it. <laughs> 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 right, I'm just like, oh my mom, can y'all know my booty? Mm -hmm. Your chickpeas do it for me. Hands down. <clears throat> That's like a lime zesty taste. That's mm -hmm. really good. Yeah. I like that. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay, you guys, so we're going to get up out of here. Don't forget to drop your comment down below. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Um, check out our groups. It's going to be in the description box down below. And, yeah, stay tuned for more videos. Right. Later, y'all. Peace. I hope it don't burn. <laughs> Something over here. And these groups got my mouth right. This is so good. Burn it inside out on my piercing. I like this. These two together. It goes so well. A potato. Like, it's like eating, like, chicken potatoes. Mm -hmm. Like, if I could just, like, break them up yeah. together and just... You try it that way. Put it, like... Break a piece of potato and, like, chicken. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's so good. Wrap it up right in the solid. I mean, <laughs> wrap it up right in the solid. I have a nice little right, That's a little candy. <laughs> <laughs> that's too much for me. Wrap it up right over the right. thing. Oh no. What are you making? Mm -hmm. A gyro? What's tomorrow? I'm going to dip for a little bit of everything. <laughs> I'm going to have me a nice sandwich over here. Like a gyro. I'm going to have this, this. I'm going to put. A little bit of this, just a little bit, but on top, it's some chicken and oh! All right, now you sound like one of them bad elementary school kids that's in the lunchroom mixing food. <laughs> that's what it sounds like. Right? Boy. And they be throwing milk in their car. Wow, man. You know what I want to do? Mm -hmm. Take away. Yeah. Mm. I need to take over some mint dressing. Fire. Mm. I saw the rice. You take a little bit. It's like a lot, right? I was getting that vibe. As I said, with the white sauce. Mm. Right? Oh my god. Right? That's good. Where was all this flavor doing the mukbang? I don't even know. It's hot in it. Right. Mm. That's good. Okay. Oh my god. See, it's a chicken, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. I don't oh know what's good. I not even taste it yet. That's good. You can have a piece of potato with that. Mm -hmm. That's good. That is. It goes better together mm -hmm. when you break the rice up. And I know what a little bit of dressing. You know what I'm oh, saying? Here, 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 like I can't. And some black pepper, maybe a little bit of cayenne. Mm -hmm. It feels like I'm eating like chicken, tomatoes, and rice. <laughs> Seriously, I never had that combo before, but it's good. right, me neither. It's supposed to be buttery. It tastes more like tomato. Mmm, that's good though. I think the, the butterfly one it. too. It's, it tastes better. Let me taste a little bit of bread. No, it probably wasn't. Yeah, well, I forgot to turn the camera.